please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, liberty and justice for all. Good morning, dogs, and happy Friday. Today you'll hear about today's weather and the weekend's weather, strides for Stacey, Maymaster, the HDTV team, a hog dog, daily sports, and a summer college success class. But for now, it's time for weather with Ivan. It's finally Friday. All right. Today's going to be high of 83 and a low of 57. It's currently 62 degrees. At lunch, it's going to be 70 degrees. So pretty good weather to go out to eat. And at 3, it's going to be 80 degrees. Tomorrow, it's going to be high of 75 and a low of 57. And for Mother's Day, yes, this Sunday, Mother's Day, it's, there will be afternoon showers. And uh, it's going to be a high of 79 and a low of 63. Now back to the studio. Thanks, Ivan. Strides for Stacy is Saturday, May 19th at 9 a.m. Registration papers are available in the bookstore. Attention students, are you behind with credits? You have the opportunity to come to school and earn them online from 3 to 6 p.m. each day. This opportunity will last until May 18th. There is no bus transportation, but we hope you will find a way to make this opportunity work for you. See guidance counselors with any questions. If you'd like to join our HGTV team next year, Please pick up a change of requ course request form in guidance. We have a need for people that want, that want to work with advanced technology or smile on camera. The 40th Annual Flora Hog Dog is Saturday, June 16th. The registration fee is $20 and registration will close June 13th. It's now time for a video about a class this summer at Ivy Tech. Good morning, hot dogs. If you're a senior planning going to Ivy Tech next year, I want to let you know about an opportunity to get a head start this summer. I'll be teaching a course called IVYT 111 Student Success. This is going to go through the differences between college and high school, how to write a good essay, proper study habits, and, and we're really going to focus on writing that solid resume to help you get a job. Now, if you're interested, just go to Frankfurt Ivy Tech anytime during business hours and let them know you're interested in IVYT 111. It's only eight days and it is a required course for Ivy Tech students. So, hope to see you this summer. Thanks, Ms. Hitsey and seniors. If you are interested in the class you will be teaching this summer, stop by Frankfurt Ivy Tech. It's now time for sports with Riley. Thanks, Ali. This past night in sports was very busy, so let's get to it. The varsity baseball team completed the conference sweep of Western Boone with an 11-2 win. Christian Lopez earned the win on the mound and added a home run. The team is now 9-2 in the conference and in first place heading into the last week of the season. The Frankfurt boys golf team returned to Frankfurt Commons for a match with Kokomo and Delphi. Frankfurt was victorious by combining the scores of match medalist JT Whitlock, Simon Weber, Casey Klaus, and Drew Grismer for 182. Kokomo posted a 2.12 and Delphi a 2.15. JV golfers Ramsey Mitchell, Nolan Varner, Camden Caesar, and Sam Wilson combined for a 2.07 to a Kokomo JV score of 2.65. Saturday, the, ho the hot dogs compete in the Crawfordsville Invitational testing their skills on the rugged municipal golf course. The Lady Hot Dog JV team defeated the Western Boone Stars JV team 13 to 8. On Thursday evening, the, the dogs started strong in the first inning, scoring seven runs. And Elisa Hernandez led the hot dog JV with four hits, Skyla Roby with three, and Taylor Bailey with one. All the lady hot dogs reached base during the game. Jocelyn Markham picks up the win for the dogs, pitching five innings, striking out two. The varsity softball team took a tough loss to the West. Aaron Boone starts 11 to 1. The dogs had a tough time defensively against the Stars. Michaela Harper took the loss pitching five and a third innings. Avery Drew, Morgan Dean, and Kimmy Kingma each collected one hit on the night. Hot Dog Varsity Softball is in action today at Clinton Prairie for the county tournament. Their first game starts at 445. 
Last night, the Lady Hot Dog Tennis team swept Lafayette Central Catholic. The record now improves to 15-3. and three. Both coaches are pleased with the players' performance. The t tennis team is back in action tonight at Northwestern. Now, back to the studio. I've talked to Mr. Potts, and Dudley, you better be training for, for the rowing contest next week. You are going down. That's all for today's announcements. Have a fantastic Friday and a wonderful weekend. We'll see you Monday. Like, what is it kind of do? Like, I was just like, what is this? This has been a <laughs> production. <gasps> <laughs> that was true.